you know, Neve. Well, you don't, but I do. And she's probably in a cafe somewhere sipping a ginger and lemon. No idea. There's a search party looking for her. She's always late. Neve is no... No self-awareness. She's so focused on driving a tank through other people's lives. Neve? Oh, Neve. Seriously. Look, do you not think it's weird that she took a different route to everybody else and never made it back to the meeting point? She always makes sure she's first and lets us all know, but not today for some reason. We were threatened by those scary American guard leaders or whatever they were, and that little group of scumbags they had with them. They're youth at risk. Youth at risk? We're the ones at risk? What? Tisha had to run back to the car park because she was worried about the car. Those delinquents were dangerous. Neve's car? Yes, yeah, she said that she was really worried. Oh, come on. Those women were crazy. <sighs> Neve called them scumbags. Little fucker spat in her car. Spit landed on the car. He wasn't aiming for it. It's her baby. Yeah, but it's not. What? A baby. It's a car. Maybe talk to Connor. Neve wasn't comfortable with him being here. Oh, fuck this. Just wait your turn and calm down. Where is she? She might have gone to a friend's house or gone to get a coffee or taken a different route of got She's lost missing. Her. What happened? What happened between leaving the car park and now? Do you know that for a fact? What? Neve didn't want Connor in the group. She didn't? Says who? Says Neil. Why did Mia not believe? They're having an affair. Seisha tried to keep it under wraps. And somehow everyone knows. Mia is in a relationship. It's just honest. What she's doing. They were forced out of the running club. It's gossip. I didn't know the girls had left the running club. But I saw them here. Today. Together. 